Ralph Ellison was a writer of immense power, his words resonated deeply. He forced us to see the unseen, he gave voice to the voiceless. Ellison's impact on American literature is undeniable, yet he remains somewhat of an enigma. Born in Oklahoma in 1914, he grew up amidst the harsh realities of segregation. Music was his early passion. This love for music would later infuse his literary works with rhythm and soul. Ellison's path took a turn when he discovered the world of literature at Tuskegee Institute. He delved into the works of literary masters, exploring themes of race, identity, and social injustice. Ellison's story reminds us that our passions can lead us down unexpected paths. Ellison's childhood was steeped in the sounds of jazz. His father dreamed of his son becoming a musician. Young Ralph embraced the trumpet. Music became an escape from the harsh realities surrounding him. In 1933, Ellison enrolled at Tuskegee Institute to further his musical aspirations. Fate, however, had other plans. At Tuskegee, he encountered the writings of Langston Hughes and Richard Wright. Inspired, Ellison began to write. He switched his major from music to English. He immersed himself in literature, attending literary gatherings and honing his craft. His time at Tuskegee marked a turning point in his life. The young musician was blossoming into a writer. In 1952, Ralph Ellison published his magnum opus, Invisible Man. The novel was an instant success, winning the National Book Award for fiction. It catapulted Ellison to literary fame, more importantly, it cemented his place as a leading voice of his generation. Invisible Man tells the story of an unnamed black man navigating the complexities of race and identity in 20th century America. The novel is a searing indictment of racial prejudice and social injustice. Through the protagonist's experiences we witness the dehumanizing effects of invisibility. We feel his frustration, his anger, his longing to be seen and heard. Ellison masterfully employs symbolism and allegory. The protagonist's journey is not merely individual but universal. He embodies the struggle of all marginalized individuals seeking to find their place in an indifferent world. Ellison's narrative technique is as captivating as his themes. He employs a stream of consciousness style allowing the reader to delve into the protagonist's innermost thoughts and feelings. This intimate portrayal draws the reader into the protagonist's world. The success of Invisible Man brought both acclaim and challenges for Ellison. He was hailed as a literary genius, a voice for the voiceless. Yet he also faced criticism from some within the black community. They felt his work wasn't militant enough, that it didn't align with the burgeoning civil rights movement. The weight of expectation, the pressure to be a spokesperson, took its toll. Ellison, ever the artist, retreated further into his work. Despite the challenges, Ellison continued to write, lecture, and engage in public discourse. His essays and lectures further explored the themes that consumed him. He delved into the complexities of race, identity, and the search for meaning in a fractured world. Ellison's later years were marked by a struggle to complete his second novel. The manuscript, vast and sprawling, remained unfinished at his death in 1994. Despite this, Ellison's impact on American letters remained undeniable. While Invisible Man remained his only published novel, Ellison's literary contributions extended far beyond its pages. He was a prolific essayist and lecturer. His words resonated with audiences across the country. His essays, collected in Shadow and Act and Going to the Territory, explored a wide range of topics. From jazz and folklore to literature and politics, Ellison's intellect shone through. He challenged readers to confront uncomfortable truths about American society. Ellison believed in the power of dialogue. He saw literature as a bridge between cultures, a way to foster understanding and empathy. His lectures were legendary, filled with passion, wit, and intellectual rigor. He inspired generations of students and writers. Despite his success, Ellison never forgot his roots. His work spoke to universal truths about identity, belonging, and the search for meaning in a complex world. Ralph Ellison's legacy continues to resonate today. His works are taught in classrooms and discussed in academic circles worldwide. His insights into race, identity, and the human condition remain as relevant as ever. In a world grappling with social injustice and political polarization, Ellison's voice offers a timeless message of hope and resilience. He reminds us that even in the face of adversity, the human spirit yearns for connection, for understanding, for visibility. 
Ellison's work challenges us to confront our own biases, to see the world through the eyes of others. He encourages us to embrace our shared humanity. His legacy is a testament to the power of literature to illuminate, to inspire, and to provoke meaningful change. Ellison's journey from trumpet player to literary icon is a story of transformation and resilience. His words continue to echo through time, reminding us that the fight for equality and justice is an ongoing struggle.